I'll show you, uh, the map is quite large. I'll kind of try and show you what's going on. So this is kind of a siege uh, thing between three different servers. That's a weird sound. So here you can see the borderlands. Yeah, it looks like we did take it back. It looks like we're actually being pushed on uh, this tower here, and we're attacking the blue supply camp, I think. Uh, but battles are marked with these little uh, crossed swords. Anything that's under attack will have crossed swords on it as well. Looks like that camp in the center is actually unclaimed. Interesting, but you can see just how much uh, Jade Quarry, which is the blue team, is just utterly demolishing us. You can see uh, the <laughs> the other server over here, the green server, is crushed into a corner. They've actually got a keep though, so that's good. I think the problem is, and I've noticed this, is uh, guilds get onto certain servers, so one server will have a, a distinct advantage. This is a tutorial guide every entrance uh, over the others, quite frankly, because the guilds know what they're doing. Looks like we're grabbing wounded and falling back uh, to a gate. It's probably those people outside that keep. If I can remember how to get out of this place, that would be splendid. This is our main castle, by the way. Uh, sieging this is the altar tower. I'm actually gonna go north here. See if I can show off. I gotta go around this way. It looks like um, sieging this requires a lot of resources, a lot of siege equipment, a lot of people. Uh, quite frankly, just mainly because it's so large, especially with a good server that has it reinforced and. Uh, a lot of stuff like that. It looks like there's crafting stations at this castle as well. Yeah, you can see all the crafting stations. Um, but there's also a, an orb of power, which we don't have because ours was stolen, and it's at the very north side of the map uh, of your specific server's borderlands, uh, protected by a basically a raid boss. I'll just jump off that. It's cool. Also, you'll notice we're bumped up to level. We're scaled to level 80. Um, legendary defender. Unshakable, determined, determined. Cool beans. Uh, I want to see if I can if he's actually here or not. It's a supply camp. Where am I going? Okay, we are going the right way. But it's actually protected by a large raid boss style thing. It requires a massive amount of people to actually take the guy down. But then you can take the orb of power, which provides a boost to the server. Is that a Jade Quarry guy? It is. What is this guy doing? Let's see, how did he get in here? Do we have like Breach? Are there a bunch of people in here? I don't know. But you can see he's in a guild, he's in a VA guild. There's a ton of people in the Jade Quarry server that are in a guild. This guy's ranged, so he's just gonna kite me to death, and I don't really want to deal with that. So I'll just kind of run around here. Where is he? I think he's just sitting up top trying to mess with me. Oh, he's actually getting all the... Yeah, it's whatever. I don't care. There's an ally over here, though. I'm too slow to honestly chase someone who has a speed buff and has a ranged weapon, so I'm not going to deal with that. Uh, that's just going to be a giant waste of my time. Is the dude up here. Steve Sosker. New event nearby. Repel the enemy attackers. Apparently red supply camp's under attack or something. But it looks like our defender has long since died, which is saddening, which would make sense because, quite frankly, we had our orb of power stolen quite a while ago, which, alas, sad day. Regardless, though, it appears, yeah, I don't know what that guy's doing. He just kind of charged in there. Now he's going to die. Without any of my hope, and he's dead. I don't know why Steve Sauce didn't just finish him. Uh, in PvP, you have a insta-kill ability. I wanna... Do we have any more teleports? It does not look like we do. So I'll go out this way. This is a big map. It takes a long time to get around it. If you haven't figured it out yet, that guy looks like he's just getting resources. Which is fine and dandy. That guy's making sure no one takes the camp. Taking uh, everything on the map pretty hard thing to do. Jade Quarry appears to be quite capable of doing it, though, so there you go. I just realized I had a trait, didn't I, hit? So let's bump that up some more. That'll give me some extra hit points. Which is good news, because my equipment is garbage compared to a level 80. 
Uh, keep in mind, a person with level 80 equipment in World vs. World is going to be better than someone with level 20 equipment, obviously. If you haven't figured that out yet. Can I pick these? With the equipment I have? I can. Cool beans. Also, World vs. World is one of the better places to actually get resources. Is that my team, or is that Jade Query? Veteran Guard, Veteran Scout. That's my team that's running around over there. There's a wolf! Dude's being hit by a wolf. Also, there's probably still a large battle going on down here. What is that? Catapult build site. I'm actually going to go put my resources into this and see if I can finish it. Um, I only have ten resources. So I don't think I'll be able to finish it. Hey, I did. Nice. Uh... So let's just kind of rotate here. Very, very, very slowly. I don't know what these guys are doing. They appear to be just attacking the wolves for whatever reason. Do, do, do. I'm actually going to open up the map while I do that, because that's going to take a while. We own that castle, right? Yes. Appears we're actually pushing them back. So that's always good. I'm just going to rotate this toward that in the event that we ever need to use it. I don't believe you can move these. So... Can you move them? No. I can load a catapult, though. Uh, except I don't have any stones, do I? Let's fire some gravel! Yay! I don't, don't have any stones to load that. We'll just leave that there. You get experience for building stuff, you get experience for repairing stuff, you get experience for fighting stuff. Uh, you get experience for doing things. <laughs> Much like the rest of the game, anything you do here will get you experience. Keep in mind that uh, your experience goes to your actual level, so you can level up entirely from PvP. Just so you know, it looks like we've got some defenders relaxing on that castle there. There's a uh, battering ram at the door. And it looks like this is where the battle is. It looks like it's between us and Jade Query, which means Jade Query is going to win. Much as they always do. Falling back to the tower, which is fine by me. Sadly, I do not have a ranged weapon. Owners of the tower can use that gateway there to get in and out easily. Which is good news. So we'll get up on the walls here and see what we can see. Note that you can destroy walls and uh, basically anything else of the castle. Anything that you can see that's highlightable here you can destroy with a catapult or whatever. What's going on down here? kind of want to stay in the fight, but I'm worried about the fact that they have like 700 people. But uh, you know what? Let's stay in it. I'll just jump off and hurt myself there. We'll summon this dude. Uh, now see, now there's 700 of them. <laughs> I don't... I don't really want to deal with that. I'm just gonna slowly back up. We should probably kill this battering ram. I'll slap that down. Pop this to help some people out. Pop an AoE shield. So we're obviously outnumbered, but we do have this castle, so we have people up on the walls. Yeah, flee. We do have people up on the walls. Was it fake? That are helping us out here. You can see they're up there firing off rounds and stuff. But they're actually building a catapult back there. Which is bad news bears for us. Probably shouldn't stand in that, but we'll roll with it. Because I am melee, I'm kind of just resorted to uh, assisting other people. There's a healing turret here. I would like if your healing turret healed us faster. Uh, those are fakes, yeah. Ranged classes have a distinct advantage in this, uh, quite frankly, because they can just sit back here and actually deal good damage. Uh, whereas for me, I'm just kind of here. So I'm gonna try and kill this dude's spider that's over here. Try not to get too focused on it, because there are 800 red names in front of me. Holy Jesus. 
We are going to lose this. Now you see why we lo we're losing this. I need to run off. Ouch. Now you see why we're actually losing against them. They're way too good. Uh, they're way too organized. They've got siege equipment in the back that's assisting them in this fight. I know they were building a catapult. Uh, which is just bad news bears for us. I'm going to see if I can get up on the walls here. Hop. I don't know why I went the long way around, but whatever. So you can see the people who did stay on the ground are actually getting pushed away from the tower, which is bad news for them. Um... I really wish I had a ranged attack, but oh well. I can teleport down off of the walls, uh, so I should be alright there. As long as I don't teleport too far away from the walls. There's a dead guy down there. He's up. I'm just making sure people get into the door. There's another dead guy, but quite frankly, I don't know how well that's going to go. Let's pop down this to help people out. Anyone who needs to heal can stand in that. Teleport. <laughs> I love doing that. Someone kill this guy. There we go, I got it. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Uh, I didn't mean to pick that up, but we'll roll with it. I'll carry the banner. Uh, how do I plant it? I don't know if my guy was glitching out there. There we go, we'll plant that down. We're actually pushing them back. Which is pretty darn good. I'm kind of surprised we're capable of doing that. Uh, did we destroy their siege equipment? It looks like we did. These freaking wolves are getting in the way. There we go. So this is what World vs. World is. It's very large battles. Uh, the strategic side will win the fight. Uh, and quite frankly, I think they're gonna, yeah, they're gonna probably keep us out of this wall because they do have it defended up. They've got defenders, archers up there. They've got a ballista. Um, they've got their guard. These NPCs come with the castle, so they're kind of common, common situation around here. Pop that off. We'll try and kill this guard here. Keep in mind, I am only level 19, so I'm not going to be quite as effective as some other people might be. Also, sieging this without any siege equipment is going to be impossible, especially with them defending it. Ouch. I got stunned. Back up, back up. Heal. Let's see if I can help this guy back up. Ow. That's that ballista that's shooting us, by the way. It hurts a lot. A ballista is... I think he's actually... Yeah, he looks like he's... I yeah, killed someone else. Looks like he knocks someone down and then just starts shooting other people. I don't know why we're staying here. We're not going to win. The thing with an organized group... Did someone else die? Yeah. Is that they can hold a... Uh, they can hold a wall with very few people against an overwhelming number, as you can see here. Just a few ballista, a few archers. Uh... And they're just destroying us. You cannot do this without uh, siege equipment. And you can see we technically had more people than them. I don't know what happened to all of our dudes. Also don't know what these idiots are doing. Trying to kill it without siege equipment. But there's that. You can see just in that time span we've gone from there to there. I'm just going to back up while I look at the map so I don't get murdered. But you can see the massive scale of this. And uh, let's see if these guys are fighting over here. I don't see any battle symbols. Or I should say, I don't see any uh, under attack symbols. There's their altar of power. They put it in that keep, which was a good idea. I don't know where blues are. Am I being attacked? No, they're still holding them off. Where are blues altars of power? Hmm. There's one. They've got theirs well hidden, because getting to that keep, when they're pushing us back all the way over here, is... may as well be impossible. I don't know where their other one is. I hear sound. No, I'm not under attack. All right. 
I don't know where their other one is, but I do know they have two of them. There it is. So they've got both of them in those keeps that are surrounded by water. It looks like that's probably a good defensive spot. These people know what they're doing, so I'm just taking notes from what they're doing. Um, and quite frankly, it appears that putting it in that keep is probably the best way to go. Every two weeks, uh, it will reset so you'll have a new chance to try your best at murdering people. Uh, the winning server will play other winning servers, the losing server will play other losing servers. Uh, kind of standard affair. Let's see if I can get this guy revived before they get murdered. I'm gonna go ahead and say no because he's getting ballisted. Yeah, I gotta back off. That's a good way to handle a ballista, is to just shoot the guy that people are trying to revive. They go ahead and just fall back. Yeah, see, they got their reinforcements back out of the gate, and now we're being pushed back. I don't know what that guy's doing. A good uh, world versus world group will use a lot of scouting. So you see they've got people coming in, flanking around behind us. we have actually been attacked for a while here now. I don't want to deal with that guy. Is this guy dead? If he is, I can't hit him, so whatever. Is this guy dead? I just want to make sure finish them doesn't pop up. Which it appears it's not going to, so he's just going to run off in that direction. All these dead people laying around. What they're actually doing, I imagine there's another Oss guy. You can see there's a lot of AUA, AUS. Uh, there's a lot of kills here. I'm actually going to run away. Because they are sieging the gate now. Yay. I'm going to get up on the walls here. Of course the tower is under attack. The tower is going to be under attack until they take it. Uh, this is a 24-hour battle, by the way, so just keep that in mind. I'll put down a heal aura over here for these guys. Also removes conditions, if you haven't noticed that. Which is good to know. It looks like they're building a ram. Yeah. But you can see just how a few ranged people are actually capable of holding them off of the gate. Summon the power of Earth. Me not being ranged, I'm relatively useless. I'm actually going to drop back down here. Whoa, I went through the gate, I didn't mean to. Because I just want to get this thing killed. Actually, they're frightening me. Crap. This is actually probably one of the better fights we've had with Jade Query. Uh, usually they just demolish us in battles. This is actually kind of a back and forth kind of battle. This. What are these doing? I'm invisible. There we go. So we're pushing them back. I'm not sure why we're pushing them back, but we are. Uh, they're just going to stop us at that gate again because we have no siege equipment. But I'll run up with them just to... Oh, there is... Oh, what are we doing? Oh, we're building a catapult. Oh, I don't have any... Uh, I don't have any stuff to build it with. Oh, they destroyed it. What'd they do that for? What? Was that not ours? There's a banner strength. Which I cannot pick up for whatever reason, but whatever. Uh, again, I don't know... We appear to not have siege equipment. So, I'm not sure what exactly they're doing, especially since this is an actual fort. It's going to be very hard to be killed by a freaking wolf. It's going to be very hard to take it without siege equipment. Let's get this guy killed. Boof, fire. There we go. And back to watching this. This guy's killing an innocent white moa. And, yep, we're losing people again. Yeah, we're losing people. But it's just going to be this for a while. Uh, it would be a more intelligent idea to actually take that supply camp. We'll have an issue holding it, but it'll give us more supplies. Hmm. I'm actually going to... For the sake of actually getting this skill point and showing you that skill point, I'm going to run back over here. And someone finally said, don't we need siege? Of course you need she siege. 
Before I actually run over there, I'm just going to stand by this castle for a moment. Uh, because that uh, Repel the Enemy Attackers one is about to wear off, and it looks like we're bailing on that assault anyway, yeah. Because, again, we have no siege equipment. If we could probably get a few people who could afford it, we could get a few catapults. Um, and then just blow that gate down from the distance farther than their ballista can shoot. And... pop. Alright. I didn't get anything out of it, probably because I didn't do very much. But regardless... Uh, there's a dead guy there. There's our convoy with its de with its uh, protection. There's tons of people. I don't know what the limit is for world versus world maps. I know there is a limit because it'll tell you that you need to wait for the queue. Uh, I wish we could use that catapult. But uh, it seems like it's a pretty big limit just from the sheer number of people that I can see running around. I mean... I'm pretty sure that's not all of our people in that area, because that uh, blue supply camp that's down there has been under attack for quite a while. I need to go down. That's a big drop. Ouch. It's cool I got this. Doing it again. Oh, I died. Well, that's disappointing, isn't it? There's some enemies over there, actually. Are those Jade Quarry? No, they're just foragers. Killing some moas, it's alright. Well, that is they're actually... Looks like we've actually got a battle on uh, Cliffside as well. Interesting. So we're actually fighting for both sides of Fort Aspenwood here. Which probably is one of the better ideas I've seen. <laughs> they can go around those, but that will allow us to uh, pincer attack Fort Aspenwood here which should give us a better uh, possibility of taking it. It is a hard place to take. It is a, a keep, so, or a garrison, I should say. I don't think it's actually a keep, is it? Yeah, it is a keep, okay. I still think uh, this keep over here is one of the better ones because it's got this double, uh, double entryway area, technically triple entryway. Uh, and then this side's the same thing. You have to go through a lot of entry areas uh, where you can just be... Uh, corralled into a small area and butchered by AoE stuff. But, yep, no one's taken that center one. Is that center one uh, not taken on all of the maps? That one doesn't even have a center. Neither does that. Interesting. Or maybe we can only see those because it's on our map, but whatever. I killed myself. Like a dingus. Um, but that is World vs. World, that is my second video. I'll probably show you one uh, later, or maybe another World vs. World, where I actually attempt to do something. Or, I will probably won't do more World vs. World until it resets, because quite frankly, Jade Query is winning. Um, they're going to win. Next tally in five seconds. Let's just see how much everyone's scores go by. It's right there, by the way, how much they'll go up by. Hmm... I do have to load the thing again. Or is it tallying? I don't know. Uh, but anyway, that's it. That's it for this video. There's my uh, dead corpse. Died from jumping off a cliff like a dingus. Sigh.